everyone, it's Emily here and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am bringing you guys another massive try on haul and this time it is from Primark. Honestly, the stuff they have in Primark at the minute, it is just so, so good. Not only did I get one, not two, not three, four bags. Four bags of Primark stuff. Yes, I know. It is just supplying the goods. Like, I see stuff in Primark that I would usually get in H&M or Zara, but for a fraction of the price. Honestly, Primark are providing the dupes this autumn season. So in this haul, I am providing lots of autumnal and winter fashion. So jumpers, blazers, skirts, homewear, a little bit of homeware, I will say. Lots of neutrals as well. I'm sorry, guys. You know me. The minute it hits autumn and winter, I am a neutral queen. So if you guys do enjoy watching today's video, then please remember, as always, to leave it a huge thumbs up. And please remember to subscribe if you haven't already. So let's jump straight in. Honestly, I have so much great stuff to show you in today's massive Primark haul. Right, so I'm going to kickstart this haul with the new in Rita Aura collection. Honestly, I saw the stuff in Primark and I was shocked at how stunning literally nearly all the collection was. I honestly loved nearly every single item that I saw from her collection, but I bought two and I'm going to show them first in this haul. Starting off with this gorgeous brown blazer. There's one aspect to it that honestly I had to get. It cinches in at the back with a little tie and bow. It looks so, so, so stunning. I really, 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 really want to get back into wearing blazers, particularly in autumn, because most of my blazers are either brown or I believe I have one in khaki and a beige as well. So I really want to get into wearing blazers instead of wearing just a jacket. I want to wear a blazer instead. But honestly, that tie at the back cinches in my waist and gives me that gorgeous hourglass figure that I love. The quality as well. Honestly, I feel like Primark has really upped their quality on their items of clothing throughout the years. And this was the most expensive item, I believe, in today's haul. It's £34 but for a blazer of this quality, I'm more than happy to pay that. I also sized up to a size 12 just to give it that little slightly more oversized look because then when you have the tie at the back, it cinches everything in anyway. So I sized up as well for the arm lengths as well. Being a tall girl, I've got longer arms, but yeah, the colour, the quality, I'm so excited to wear this. I might even take this to New York. We shall see. The other item that I got from the Rita Ora Primark collection is this gorgeous cable knitted jumper. And I just loved the black stitching detail on the shoulders and then where it goes into the sleeve. I don't own anything like this. This is always my excuse when I buy another beige jumper, but it is, I'm sorry, that's going to be my excuse. I don't own a jumper like this. The high neck detail, I just love going from autumn into winter. I'm just so excited to wear this. Again, the quality, it's so thick, it's so warm, super, super soft as well. Like I said, Primark's quality of their jumpers has just got better and better and better. And I honestly, I'm so excited to wear this. And how much was this? This came in at £20 and I got this in a medium. The medium was the biggest size they had. Maybe if that was a large, I would have opted for that. But beggars can't be choosers. When you see an item like this, you have to get it. That's the thing with Primark. If you see something, you have to get it because otherwise we are risking disappointment if we go back next time and it's not there. But yeah, a stunning beige cable knit jumper with that gorgeous black stitching. I'm so excited to wear another staple to my jumper wardrobe that I can't wait to wear. While we're on the subject of creamy beige oversized jumpers, 
I might as well show you another one that I bought. I saw this style of jumper last year in H&M and never got my hands on it. H&M had it in stock again this year, but I actually saw that Primark had the same jumper. And of course it was a fraction of the price, but the same amazing quality. And it is this gorgeous v-neck collared jumper. I just love it. I feel like this is me in a jumper. I feel like if my friends walked into Primark, saw this jumper, they'd be like, yep, yeah, Emily's getting that because I just love it. The quality as well, it's so, so, so soft. I think on the label, yeah, it says it does contain wool and it was only 13 pounds. I got this in a large. I love sizing up with jumpers. The bigger, the baggier, the more oversized, the better. I just want to put on a jumper and it'd be super, super slouchy that I can start with either some leather leggings or just normal leggings, jeans, maybe a skirt. Who knows? But yeah, this is honestly, I've been eyeing this up. I eyed up last year, didn't get my hands on it. And the fact that Primark did its own version this year, I had to get it. I just did. Honestly, the quality is amazing. Super, super soft, super oversized. I just, yeah, I can't wait to wear it. Another beige jumper, I know, but I had to add it to my collection. Let's just take a break from the neutral jumpers for a minute and I'll break it up with a pair of shoes. So, going to New York, literally, actually, I'll be back or flying back from New York when this is uploaded, but I actually don't own a pair of black heels. I actually really need to go for my wardrobe. I've said already a video is coming soon. I really need to sort my wardrobe, particularly shoes. I need to be very, very, very specific and very fussy when it comes to what shoes I actually want to keep in my collection because I have so many pairs of heels particularly that I never wear. And I just want to narrow it down and have literally a stable pair of white, a stable pair of black, and then maybe a clear pair and a nude pair, who knows? But all I can wear when it comes to heels is mules. And I know that slingbacks are so in and they're so stunning, so staple, they'll go with anything. And I was on the hunt for a pair of black slingback heels and Josh actually found them. And they are these, I'm sorry. How stunning are these heels? Honestly, that is the highest I can wear. I'm five for eight, I don't need to wear heels, but if I do, I just want a small pair that I can walk in and they are so, so, so pretty. The pattern as well, it is giving designer dupe. And these were 14 pounds 14 pounds they look like designer slingback heels i'm honestly so excited such a staple to my shoe collection these are 100 coming to new york i'm thinking these with some trousers jeans maybe even that blazer that i just showed you but yeah i'm so excited to wear these they do not hurt my feet well i hope they won't anyway just a classic pair of black slingbacks that yeah they're so in and primark are just providing the goods 14 pounds I can't wait to wear these and I hope I do. I just have one more, I promise, one more neutral oversized jumper to show you. And it is this gorgeous cream cable knitted jumper. I actually sized up. So I got this in a size 10 to 12 again, because I actually really, really want to wear this more as a jumper dress, maybe with some little shorts underneath just for security, because it is a little bit short, but that's what I envisioned. I don't own a jumper dress like this. I don't really own a lot of jumper dresses. That's something that I would love because I love the idea of a jumper dress boots and tights it just looks so so pretty but yeah i love a roll neck jumper as well if you know you know i love anything high neck roll neck in the autumn winter time the quality again it's so so soft again the material contains wool primark quality of their jumpers are just they're just amazing. So yeah, I got this in a size small, which is a 10 to 12, and it was 20 pounds. Again, I just am so excited to wear this. I'm thinking this with either black tights and black boots, or even I could probably get away with maybe some like tan colored tights and my cream boots, we shall see if they go. But yeah, I just love an oversized cable knitted jumper. Honestly, they have my heart. They are my favorite thing to wear. 
at this time of year. So yeah, this is the final cable knitted jumper that's neutral, I promise, but I saw it, I had to get it. It's just me in a jumper. This is my favourite. Honestly, I say every season's my favourite, but I really do love the staples that I have in my wardrobe when it comes to autumn and winter. Let's steer away from clothing at the minute. And in this bag, I have lots of accessories as well as a few candles. I know it's me guys, it's not a haul unless I have a candle. I'm sorry, but let's start off with this scarf. I love Primark scarves, especially this starter scarf, the oversized, soft, kind of felty, wool-like in texture scarves. I had to get this one. I've got this, but plain white. But when I saw the beige and the gray stripes, I was like, this is gonna go with literally every single outfit that I own because what do I wear at autumn and winter? Neutrals. So yeah, I got this and this was £8, but the quality is amazing. Yeah, Primark scarves just provide. So I thought I'd add a new one to the collection. And then I also picked up these felt in style caps. So I got one in this charcoal grey and then one in this creamy oatmeal shade and they were both four pound each and yeah just again another great accessory which is going to go with so many of my outfits i really want to start accessorizing my outfits more so whether it's a scarf hat jewelry it's something that i definitely want to do because it just adds that little bit extra to my outfits so i saw these out for four pounds i wanted to get both colorways so yeah four pound great quality and yeah i just want to start playing around with my accessories i do love myself a beanie in the winter so when i saw those fabricy felty caps i thought let's buy them let's style them and see what happens i also picked myself up i got these last year i love them they're a pound and they are little cream gloves but they are also touch screens so you can wear them and use your phone without worrying about taking your gloves on off on off just to use your phone so yeah they're a staple to my autumn and winter my hands get cold so quickly because for a tall person they are very small they are i have really small hands for someone who is tall but yeah they are pound and of course i got them in cream because it's me, so yeah, I got them last year, absolutely ruined them when I was working. I needed a new pair, so when I saw them, they went straight in my basket. Hair accessory wise, I can't go to Primark without getting myself some claw clips. It's actually a bit of an addiction. I cannot go into that store without getting new claw clips. I just love, 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 love a claw clip. So these were £3.50 and I just love them. That one particularly is so, so, so pretty, the pearly one. And then of course, a neutral claw clip as well to go with so many of my outfits and as well as this really cute beige bow for three pounds i got one in white and i haven't worn it yet so i'm going to find an excuse to wear this i'm thinking really cute half up half down with one of my oversized jumpers it's just gonna look super super cute so three pounds yeah just very very girly and i just really liked it i get all my socks from primark so i picked up these two pairs of slouch cozy socks and they were four pound fifty i don't know if you can actually see them but they are ribbed and super super soft and i thought they would look great with my ugg boots because i haven't got them out yet but yeah i just have seen all the girls starting their ugg boots with socks like this so for four pound fifty i had to get them as well as some new kappa socks these were £4.50. I got the shorter ones rather than the longer ones, but my longer ones have gone walkabouts. I have no idea where they've gone. I don't know if my sister has them. I don't know if even my brother might have them, but yeah, I need to find them. But £4.50, some new Kappa socks to go again with either my Uggs or my trainers. Yeah, I just love Primark socks. I get all my socks and all my underwear from Primark because not only is it super affordable, they're just so, so, so comfy. The last things in this bag is of course from their home section and I just cannot leave Primark without getting some sort of candle. I tried but I smelt this and I just couldn't resist. It was four pounds and it's in the scent Cedarwood and Vanilla. It is so, 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 so nice. Yeah, I just honestly love it. That vanilla -y scent is just so, so, so gorgeous. And the cedarwood in it just gives that extra something different that I, that I don't have in my candle collection. I feel like I say that every single time 
I buy a candle that I don't have it, but I'm sorry. I have an addiction. And at least I'm admitting that I have a candle addiction because especially in autumn and winter, every day a candle gets lit. I can guarantee you. So even though I have a lot, I get through them. And then finally, last thing in this bag, I don't know if I've mentioned in a come shop with me or in a TikTok before, how much I love this diffuser. I don't know if you can see, cause it is quite bright in my room. It is a woman's body. And you know, I have an obsession with female naked bodies. I just do, I love the aesthetic. I know it was very in last year, but I still love it. And it is a diffuser, of course, but it's just gonna look so, so, so nice in my room. I cannot wait to put it on display. And it's in the scent Rose and Amber Nectar, and it can last up to nine weeks. And this came to seven pounds. I've seen it so many times in Primark and I haven't got it. because so I'm like, Emily, you don't need it. But this time, I'm sorry, I just couldn't resist. I caved, I'm sorry, I know I have so many diffusers that I need to get through, but it's just another one to add to the collection. Right, back to COVID and we are on to the last few items. I love an oversized hoodie, sweatshirt. You guys know it's all I wear when I'm at home. So when I saw this Disney hoodie, you knew it was going straight in my basket. Look at it. It is so, so, so lovely. It is cream and it literally just says the true original with Mickey Mouse on it. And then Mickey Mouse on the back. Looking a bit grumpy, but honestly, I just love it. I definitely sized up with this. This is very, very big, but I just love an oversized hoodie. So yeah, I got this in a large and it was 16 pounds and I just had to get it. I don't have, I keep saying I don't have this. I don't have that. I don't, sorry guys. That is my, that is my excuse I tell myself when I buy things. Because even though I have bought quite a few Disney hoodies, Disney sweatshirts from Primark, I never got my hands on a Mickey Mouse one. And yeah, I just love it. Super, super soft, great quality. I love an oversized hoodie. I couldn't resist, sorry guys. I'm going to end today's haul with two skirts. I know, a skirt. I'm shocked every single time I say this in a haul, but I say it as well every time. I'm really trying to get myself into other items of clothing that aren't just jeans. And I thought autumn would be the perfect time. So I picked up this really lovely brown mini skirt. I love the soft material. It's super stretchy as well. A zip on the side too. And it actually fits me and it fits so nicely. This was actually true to size. I got this in a size eight. It was 10 pounds. And is this not just a really cute autumnal skirt i'm definitely thinking of starting this with maybe like one of my like long sleeve skim dupe tops or even my short sleeve ones at the minute while it's mild up but yeah i'm really excited to style this and yeah it's just gonna be a nice little autumnal staple skirt to add to my collection as well as this staple skirt it is a well on me it's more than midi maxi i feel like it is meant to be a maxi but when you're as tall as me it's really hard to find something that is truly truly maxi but it is this gorgeous maxi cargo skirt this was such a task to find because i actually bought one in lakeside and i didn't check the skirt and it had a stain on the back but i actually did the click and collect service that primark are trialing to get a new one because generally i couldn't find this in any of my closest local primarks but it was definitely worth the search and going to oxford street to click and collect this i was in london anyway i didn't just go to london just to get this skirt i was already there but honestly i'm so happy i got my hands on a stain free one of this and i got this in a size eight i got it in a size eight and it fits kind of on my belly button if i wanted it to sit a little bit lower then i maybe would have sized up to a 10 but honestly I love it. You guys know how much I love cargoes. They're very much an item that I love to wear this time of year. So why not get myself a long 
cargo skirt again the color is me to a t we love neutrals so yeah i'm super excited to wear this again with maybe one of my skims tops and some trainers honestly great quality again fits me so well yeah primark is just really providing the goods this season so that is the end of today's video today's massive primark autumn trial and haul i hope you guys have enjoyed and even seen a few items that you like and if you do remember to run to primark to find it before it's gone or even do what i did and trial their click and collect service honestly it was so 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 good and i really hope that they branch it out into more local primarks but anyway guys i hope you have enjoyed watching today's video if you have then please remember as always to leave it a huge thumbs up and please remember to subscribe if you haven't already so yeah thank you guys so much if you have gotten to the end of today's video i love you all so much and i will see you next time with a brand new video bye